All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Family Feud Catholic Style. My name is Emma Showalter, and I will be your host from the Dodge City Diocese. And I'm Matea Gregg, and I will be the co-host from the Salina Diocese. Hey, we got a good one for you today, guys. We got Salina Diocese versus Dodge City Diocese today, uh, represented by our finest priests and seminarian. Um, a huge thank you to everybody who answered the survey. We had over 400 participants. <laughs> uh, let's, without further ado, let's get started. Uh, give me Father Ted and give me Father Jarrett. We're, we're playing. <laughs> <laughs> we're live. <laughs> but, uh... All right, um, we'll let our guests go first. So Father Jarrett, your first question. We got the top eight answers on the board. Name an animal um, Noah might have had a hard time catching two of for his ark. Uh, I'm gonna go with fleas. <laughs> because Come on. <laughs> All right, Father Ted. A giraffe. Oh, sir. No. Oh. All right, Salina Diocese. Uh, hey, Father Jarrett, I'll let you introduce yourself. Where are you from? Where are you at? Where are you going? Uh, I am Father Jarrett Conradi, and I am from the Diocese of Salina. If I need to say that, <laughs> although I think I'm, uh, I think I'm actually on the side. I don't know if people can see that, but I'm on the side of all the Dodge City guys. So uh, anyways, but uh, I'm uh, from the Diocese of Salina, currently serving in uh, Hayes, Kansas. And, uh, oh, are we not playing from Dodge City? Um, <laughs> anyways, uh, I'm a priest in Hayes at uh, St. Nicholas of Myra and Munger St. Francis of Assisi. And as of July 1st, moving to Beloit, Kansas and Cocker City for a new assignment. Very good, thank you. All right, Father Gale, name an animal Noah might have had a hard time catching Tua for his arc. Uh, uh, this is very nerve wracking. Um, I'm not even sure if I have unmuted myself. So uh, can you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> Are you doing okay. a Google search right now? <laughs> <laughs> I am going with uh, this is too hard. I don't like this question. I'm going to go with uh, a hummingbird. <laughs> <laughs> Survey says. No. Okay. Okay. I forgot to ask you, Father Gale, where are you from and where are you going? I grew up in Hayes, America. I, li I live currently in the little Apple, Manhattan, Kansas. I'm the chaplain at Kansas State University at St. Isidore's Parish. Very good. All right. Uh, Father Andrew, can you introduce yourself for us? Uh, my name is Father Andrew Rockers uh, in the Slanted Diocese, currently stationed in Goodland and Sharon Springs. All right, and name an animal Noah might have had a hard time catching two of for his arc. I'm going to go with rabbit. Survey says. Good answer, good answer. Uh, not that good. That's <laughs> <laughs> okay. it. Um, let's see. I'm going to, uh, go with my first instincts on this one, which is, uh, an elephant. Come on, people. Let's go team. Let's go. Yeah. You're doing all right. You're doing all right. All okay. Right. Is it my turn? Yep. Um, I'm gonna go with a whale. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> good answer. Good answer. <laughs> Come on. All right, Dodge City hey. Diocese, be thinking. You oh, can we're ready. We're ready. We are ready. Father Andrew, name an animal. Noah might have had a hard time catching two of for his arc. A lion. Yeah. Good job. Good answer. All right, back to the top, Father Jarrett. Uh, is it my turn already again? I just went. <laughs> it's uh, your turn again. Yeah, let's, I, honestly, my first thought was hippo, so I'm going hippo. Says, I heard, I heard, damn it. 
I was kind of secretly hoping that you didn't get that because I don't have any good answers. Left. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to be the guy. I heard a ding, but the reason it dinged is because the guys in the kitchen are watching and it's like at a 12 second delay. So, <laughs> Dang. Well, we each missed one there. So at least we're equally losers. <laughs> good try. Good good try. Diocese, you have a chance to steal. Um, Adam, do you have a suggestion for your team captain? Yes, my suggestion is a cheetah. All right, Father do Jacob, think? do you have a suggestion? My suggestion would be a porcupine. <laughs> <laughs> and Father Ted, team captain, uh, you can either use one of the suggestions or or come up with your own. We're going cheetah. All right. Good answer. So Good answer. Woo! Yes, no! Go. Yeah. <laughs> well done. Well done. Good job. Good, Good job, job. Adam. And All right. I, I got a question. Yes. Did, it, did we not have the chance to pass it over to them? We didn't. Oh, we, like, we did not give you that chance. <laughs> yeah, I was. I've been instructed this morning that always pass. So anyway, <laughs> now, now now they're gonna pass it to us. We're gonna lose again. Uh, okay, I shouldn't have given away my. You shouldn't have said anything. You guys did I'm great. Fine. You guys did great. Good work. Yeah, thank you. Good work. Thank you very much. I'll tell you that we got many animals, but we had to narrow it down to the top eight. Um, and the ones that you did mention were some that were that we got sure. answers for, but they weren't the top. So the number five answer is. A snake. snake. Yes. That's what we <laughs> Number seven would have been alligator. And then number eight would have been porcupine. <laughs> would have been a dinosaur. All right. <laughs> give me Father Jacob and give me Father Gail. All right. Try to try to Saint John Vianney. Amen. Okay, this Amen. Time the Dodge City Diocese will have the chance to answer first. So we got the top eight answers on the board. What is something a priest might do in his free time? Father Jacob, watch you're up. Watch movies. Watch movies. Watch movies. Says. <laughs> uh, <Whoa>. <laughs> <laughs> you guys aren't watching any movies. Uh, I would say read. All right, Salina Diocese, would you like to pass or play? We'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that means uh, we go over to the Dodge City Diocese, and Adam, you're up. Would you like to introduce yourself for us? So my name's Adam Urban. I'm uh, currently a seminarian at St. John Vianney Seminary in Denver. I'll be heading into my second year of philosophy, and I'm originally from um, Hayes, America, um, but... Uh, via God's grace and uh, some crazy experiences, I ended up in the Dodge City Diocese. And I thought, you know, both are pretty dysfunctional families. Uh, <laughs> so I'll just stay in Dodge. And uh, yeah, I've been there ever since. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're glad to have you. <laughs> I'm going to go with uh, sleep in their free time. Survey says. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> All right, Father Ted, what is something a priest might do in his free time? I would say golf. Nice. Yeah. <clears throat> and before we go on, sorry, Father Ted, would you like to introduce yourself? Hey, my name is Father Ted Steckline. My family originated in Munger, Kansas. Wow. Woo! Yeah, and I grew up Ellis in County. <laughs> And I defected from there in night, late 90s, 90s, and then um, traveled around the world. Well, really just Canada and the United States. Ended up in Garden City, Kansas. Some people gave me some soup and some bread. So you know, <laughs> I stayed there. And uh, right now I'm pastor of uh, St. Anthony of Padua in liberal Kansas in Satanta. Uh, in Al St. Alphonsus in Satanta, Kansas. That's me. Thank you for, for joining us tonight. Sure. Uh, Father Jacob, can you introduce yourself for us? Father Jacob Schneider, uh, born and raised Barton County, home parish of St. Anne's in Almitz. Um, I am currently the pastor at St. Mary's in Garden City, Kansas. I, I went to college in Hayes, I guess, but I'm a college dropout 
and uh, still don't have an undergrad, folks, but uh, I'm, a, I'm a priest and the pastor out here at St. Mary's, so. Great, thank you for joining us. What is yeah. something a priest might do in his free time? How about cook? Survey says. Oh, wow. All right, Adam, we're back to you. What is something a priest might do in his free time? I'm going to go with visit friends. Good answer. Father Ted, back up to the top. Uh, hunt, shoot things. Mm. Oh. oh. All right, Salina, they've got two strikes. You can steal. Uh, Father Jacob. How about just exercise? Survey says. <laughs> yeah, I got one. I got to go, man. <laughs> Adam. Oh, man. Um, I am going to go with. Man, I don't know. <laughs> I know. Uh, uh, travel. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> no. Uh, uh, yeah. Well, the line of dice. Give me some, give me some good ideas, them. boys. Or how's this work? Do do does this Father Andrew and I give Father Jared an idea? Still, is that the one? The way it works. Mm -hmm. All yeah, right, that's Father Andrew, idea. bring it. My suggestion would be pray. Okay, Father Gail. My suggestion, because I'm from the Salina Diocese as well, would be pray. I was I was gonna go with bungee jump, but I think <laughs> I think uh, I think I'm gonna go with pray. Hey! Good, job. <laughs> Good job, guys. All right, so there's no prayer in the Dodge City Diocese. Come on, come <laughs> on, bungee jump. Come on, bungee jump. Well, number four right. would have been go fishing. Go fishing. <laughs> yep, and then number eight would have been go on a walk. A walk. <laughs> <laughs> Really, really, there's, there's no food on there anywhere. No, no. <laughs> hey, just today I saw something where I was, I'm a part of a cooking show. So in case you're wondering if priests actually cook, I'm a part of a cooking show. I just wow. ate Father Cody in Manhattan, did a cooking show, and I just saw it online. So big time. Yeah, it was where, good. Where was it was one good. of the answers just was not one of the top answers. So. Okay, okay, Father Rockers. Yeah, give me Adam and give me Father Andrew. Here we go, Adam. Line of Diocese, you're up first. Top eight answers are on the board. Name a reason, legitimate or not, someone might miss mass. Who goes first? Uh, Father Andrew. Sick. Survey says. <laughs> COVID. COVID-19. COVID <laughs> <laughs> Father Jacob, where's your mask? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. You know, oh my you gotta make oh some noise if you want if you want the people to see yourself. Yeah, I gotta make some noise if they're gonna check. Look at this baby. Somebody made a form and says like faith, hope, and love. It's incredible. <laughs> and it also fogs up my glasses, so I'm not sure <laughs> if it's actually doing what it's supposed to be doing, but all right, Salina Diocese, do you want to pass or play? Uh, uh Father Gill's uh strategy worked pretty well, so I'm gonna <laughs> again. All right, we're gonna pass. Uh, Dodge City, that brings us to Father Ted. Name a reason, legitimate or not, a person might miss Mass. A person or a priest? <laughs> a person. Oh, okay. Okay. They're hungover. It's <laughs> her. <laughs> 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 uh... Oh, gosh. I can't believe that was up there. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Father Jacob. <laughs> Name a reason, legitimate or not, a person might miss mass. I'm going to go with uh, they're pregnant. 
Okay. <laughs> Oh, that's a terrible answer, Father Jacob. <laughs> you can't say you that. that. You can't say that. You only say good answer. Yeah, that's right. I broke the mold. I broke uh, Father Gale's rule number two. <laughs> that's Father Drew Hoffman. We're giving that all to Father Drew Hoffman. <laughs> all right, Adam. Name a reason, legitimate or not, a person might miss mass. I'm going to go with oversleeping. Survey says. Oh. Good answer. Good answer. Back to the top, Father Ted. They had a sporting event. Bad answer. Come on, people. Get your Good answer. Is this legitimate or not? Priority, people. Uh, Father Jacob. How about traveling, visiting family? Well, that's two answers. <laughs> oh! That's all in the same one. <laughs> Just hoping one of them was on there. Adam. I'm going to go with uh, car trouble. Yeah. Oh, oh man. All right, Selena. So you've got two strikes. Be thinking of your answers. Uh, Father Ken. Oh, my gosh. Um, Okay, so this is me, right? Yes. yes. Okay. All right, just make sure. Um, mm, families in town can't get away. Survey says. Oh. Oh. All right. All right, Here so we go. You have a chance to steal. Father Andrew, what's your suggestion? Bad weather. All right, Dale. Well, I think that that was incredible, but I'm also going to throw work out there. Mm. Father Jarrett, you're the deciding factor. Oh, uh, well, I was going to go with dead, but um, <laughs> I think <laughs> the dead I mean, are I feel, like that's, I feel like that's pretty legitimate reason <laughs> to miss, but um, I think I'm going to go with work. Oh, 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 oh. Dang it. I should have gone with rockers. Wow. Father Andrew, because I'll show you in a second after I get these points away. Okay. That hurts. All That's right. The, so, I get a lot of times, a lot as a priest. Four. Number four. Number four. Bad weather. Bad weather. Oh. Who elected you team captain? <laughs> and then number five would have been. <laughs> Uh, uh, daylight. Oh, daylight savings, daylight savings time. time. Yeah. Yep. Number six would have been. Day. Oh yeah. man. Hey. All right. Hurts. Okay. Hurt. We're back up from the top, and this time it is Father Ted versus Father Jarrett, with Father Ted going first. Oh man. All right, we got, got this cousin. You got oh. this. <laughs> What is something you would not want to find in the holy water? <laughs> a fly. Survey says. Good answer. Nice. Do you want to pass or play? We're going to pass. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Father Gale, what is something gonna, you would not want to find? I'm going to go water? with uh, fish. Survey says. <laughs> Nice. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Father Andrew. I'm gonna go with hair. <laughs> Good answer. All right. Father Jarrett. Uh hold on a second. I gotta go to the bathroom real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Where do you even get that from? <laughs> <laughs> That's what Facebook is for. Uh, so anyways, uh, I'm going to go with a Band-Aid. No. Ah. Good, good. Right. Seriously? Come on. <laughs> All right, Father Gale, what is something you would not want to find in the holy water? 
I don't know if, yeah, food. I mean, food, gum. I would not want to find. Yeah, hey, both. Oh. <laughs> uh, Father Andrew. I'm going to go with saliva. Survey says. <laughs> uh, Father Jarrett, we're back to you. <laughs> you need to go to the bathroom again? Yeah, probably. We're coming. We're coming. Uh, I'm going to go with skin, body parts. <laughs> <laughs> Come on! Oh, no way. I said body parts. Somebody did say a floating finger. That was interesting. Yeah, I would not want to find that in my holy water. What do you guys have in your holy water up there? <laughs> That wasn't a person from the Dodge Diocese, right, Matea? I have no idea. <laughs> Come on, Hammer Schmidt. All right, Father Gale. Uh, I lack confidence right now. Um, <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I, I'm gonna, I was going to, yeah, I'm going to just say, are we talking like the little hand dippers or are we talking about like the big bucket of holy water? <laughs> Uh, I think if you're I'm just going to say, uh, get ready, Dodge City. I'm saying dirt. I'm saying mud. Stupid. Yes. <laughs> oh. Oh. I, got, I got lucky. You did. All right. Two answers left, but Dodge City, you got two strikes. You can have a chance to steal. So, Father Andrew. Hmm. Well, I hate to be the guy to go there, but I'm going to do it for the sake of the points. But I'm going to go with feces. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dang it. Uh, <laughs> I thought it'd be there. That was a high up there thing, but again, not in the top eight. <laughs> dang it. <laughs> Some people also thought that. All right. Uh, City. Adam, do you got a suggestion? Um, to be honest with you, no. Um, <laughs> I don't know what else would be in a holy water font. Um, that's okay. You can pass if you if you need to. But that's what do you got, Father Jacob? <laughs> Trash. Trash. That's my guess. Awesome. My turn. Yeah, yeah. Father, yeah go ahead, Father. Okay, I was just waiting. I was waiting to be called. And I was going to say fungus, but I think that goes with mold. So yeah. we'll go with trash. All right, survey says. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Yes. All right. All right. So. His, his voice. Oh. What's the, what are the numbers right now? Three and uh, eight. Selena has that, and Dodge has 481. Yeah. So number three. Yeah would have been tissue. <laughs> I'd use tissue and then number eight would have been well yeah. <laughs> makes sense or a dinosaur I mean you wouldn't want to find any of those things in the holy water <laughs> give me Father Jacob and give me Father Gale uh, All right. Father go, Gale Father go Gale. Gale. let's do it Top eight answers on the board. What saint would you ask to intercede for you when you need help? Do I go, I go first? Yeah, you go first. Uh, how about our mother Mary? <laughs> Survey says. Whoa. Ooh, number what? Two. I, number, number two? I feel sorry for everybody who said this number one answer. <laughs> <laughs> Father Jacob, do you got a guess? St. Anthony. Survey says. Oh, man. She beat oh. her. He beat her. That's crazy. Uh, All right, Dodge City, you want to pass or play? Uh, it didn't work last time, but I think it's going to work this time. Let's pass this one. Oh. Okay, Salina. Father Andrew, what saint would you ask to intercede for you when you need help? I'm going to go with St. Francis of Assisi. Survey says. Oh, seriously. Wow. Oh. Wow. Uh, 
Uh, let's go St. Joseph. <clears throat> Good answer. Um, Father Gail, back to you. Here we go with St. Jude. Yep. Okay, Father Andrew. St. Therese. <laughs> Two strikes. Hey, Emma. And okay, Mateo, guys, is, cut me. Is, yeah, is it possible to call it? <laughs> call them, <laughs> they're Siri, still calling people. Siri, call Suse. <laughs> 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 we, need, we, need a, we need a substitute. <laughs> <laughs> so great answers that were mentioned, but they uh, were like the top eight. I'm sorry. Okay. You're very kind. <sighs> All right. I lost my place. Are we Father Jarrett? Yeah, it's me. <laughs> I, I, it actually might be Father Gail next, actually. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot skip, Father. Let's go. Uh, let's go. Pope St. John Paul II. <sighs> No respect. No respect. Dang. <laughs> John City, Adam, do you got a suggestion? Mine would be um, St. Teresa of Calcutta. Okay, Father Jacob. I'm going to go with the patron saint of test takers, I believe, St. Joseph Cupertino. No, <laughs> yeah, go, go with that one, Father Ted. <laughs> Joseph Cupertino, I'm going with him too. Everybody loves him. <laughs> Call me to seminary, baby. <laughs> All right, Father Ted. St. Michael, the archangel, defend us in battle. Be Let's go. Against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke yeah. him. Oh, there yeah. you go. Finish that prayer. Well <laughs> That's why he's our king leader. The power of God's cast into hell, Satan, and the all evil spirits. All evil spirits. Spirit. Singing the role of the souls. Amen. Good job. Amen. So you all had good answers. Um, number five would have been. Mm, Saint Christopher. <laughs> number seven was. Saint Teresa of Calcutta. Number eight would have been Saint Joseph hey, Cupertino. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, round six, last round. Pressure's on. Give me Adam. Give what me score? Adam. What score, real quick? What's the score here? The score. Let's see. Dodge City Diocese, quick. 738, and Salina Diocese, 611. Oh, mercy. <laughs> Anybody's game. All right. All right. We surveyed over 450 Western Kansas. Top eight answers are on the board. What is something people do once a week besides Sunday Mass? Adam. They go to the grocery store. All right. So, mm. what city you want to pass or play? You're, do I get to call. ask my team? Your yeah. call, Adam. Was that a yes or no from the moderators? Yeah, you can ask your team. Okay, what do you think, Father Ted? Yeah, go for it. Okay, we'll take yeah. it. What you want? Right, we'll, play? we'll play it. All right. Let's go. Uh, Father Ted, <laughs> what is something people do once a week besides mass? Clip their toenails. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can't believe that's on there. <laughs> How fast do your toenails grow? <laughs> Father Jacob, what is something people do once a week besides mass? How about go out to eat, huh? Huh? All go right. out to eat. Survey says. It's up there. Adam? They go to work. Just once a week? Where are you working at? <laughs> what? He's working in the seminary. <laughs> That's about right. How do I get that job? Uh, <laughs> all right, two strikes to land a diocese. Get ready. Oh, uh, no. Uh, Father Ted. They work out. All right, they work out. Survey says. Oh, oh. Okay. Uh, 
That was I don't know if there's, there's not enough points on the board, man. Not a lot to steal, but you could take number two. Do we get the points? Like, if yeah, if we get two, we get those points as well as mm -hmm. what's already on the board? Yeah. That might have been their that might have been their strategy to just be really just terrible think. at those questions. They were texting each other and say, if yeah, if we answer a bunch of really dumb <laughs> stuff, <laughs> then they won't have enough points to beat us. That was good strategy, but we're still feeling confident. We're gonna get the number two answer. Shave your cut. Okay, so <laughs> all right. Is that is that your real suggestion? No, it's rockers. Oh, it's not my turn. <laughs> rockers. Uh my suggestion is do laundry. Okay. Father Gail. Yeah, I like that. But uh, so I know our, our target audience here, people that are answering these questions on the diocese's website are holy people. And I'm going to say, do your laundry. <laughs> <laughs> so holy adoration, but I'm going to do your laundry. Oh, come on. <laughs> Did you, okay, did you really have another option in there? I mean, like, seriously? I was going to say adoration. Okay, yeah, that's definitely not it. No, that's probably, that's probably, that's probably on there. But honestly, I think, I think, I, I think laundry is going to be higher. So let's go with laundry. Laundry? All right, yeah. survey says. Yeah. 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 yeah, I think that's enough points, too. I think we did it. <laughs> <laughs> No way! Oh. 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 <laughs> yeah, what were the other answers? Can we still see the other answers or no? Oh, um, We're done? Too late? It's yeah. fine. That's fine. I have the other answers here. Okay. Okay, hold on. I got really excited. Um, so number three would have been mow the lawn. Mm -hmm. okay. Number four would have been clean the house or clean your car. Um, the other one would have been change or wash your sheets. And then adoration would have been number seven. Yeah. And then, uh, number eight <laughs> was take out the trash. So. Nice. All right. Dang. Okay, so I need to leave the room. We get ready for fast money. We've got uh, who was it? Father Jarrett first, and then Father yeah. Gail. Yep. All right, so we'll let Father Gail leave the room. Close your ears. Close your eyes, so you can't see his answers. Um, let me let's see. Got to scroll over. Make sure he's gone. Okay. As far as I can tell, he's gone. All right, Father Jarrett, are you ready? No, hold on. You have 20 seconds, by the way. Okay. How's that uh, pizza, Father Jacob? Okay. I'm not <laughs> <Ready>. sharing. <laughs> okay, now are we ready? <laughs> yeah, let's go. All right. We surveyed 450 people. You've got 20 seconds. And the time will start after I read the first question. Name a liturgical season in the church. Lent. Name a saint whose name begins with T. Paul. Name P. a sacrament. P, right? You said no, T. Okay. T. T? T so Thomas. <laughs> name a sacrament. Baptism. Name one of the 12 apostles. Peter. Name a Marian apparition. Fatima. Awesome. All right. Good job. Solid. I have to go back. It wouldn't let me type them in for some reason. Very yeah, solid. I heard, P. I heard P. You said T, right? Yeah, T. Okay. He as in, what'd you say, Thomas? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he said Thomas. So we'll give you that. Oh my goodness. Let me go back out and go back in because it's given me technical difficulties. Anybody got some advertisements they want to plug? Yeah, go for it. All right, all right, all right. 
How did how to go? How to go? How to go? How to go? I don't know. I, we're still yet to see. Uh, I'm I'm kind of excited. I think it. Uh, I don't know. I feel like maybe I, he did. Okay. He did well. All right. I think we're in good shape. Okay. Is that his total? Is that how well he did? <laughs> <laughs> zeros, zeros across the board, baby. Okay, Let's do go. Do I have to face away? Do I have to? I, let me hold on a second. Yeah, move, move real quick while I type it in. It's giving me troubles. Hold on. Okay, so first he said, okay. I know that generally you don't look at the board when this is going on, so I'm going to just turn away. That's good. We haven't, Father Gail, we haven't answered his answers yet. So we don't even know. Leave again? Yeah, you need to leave again, is what I'm All saying. Right. That's Matea, that's not what he said for number three. It isn't? No. Oh. Okay. Well, Gail, get out of the room. <laughs> <laughs> Baptism. Oh. Is this the time for the uh, free advertising? Yeah, go for but, it. But hey, Matea, if that one was worth more points, go ahead and leave it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You go, Adam. I would like to give a shout out uh, to all of those who are discerning to come down to the Diocese of Dodge City. And uh, <laughs> yeah, basically uh, to take away from Salina and uh, plug our two vocation rectors, Father Ted and Father Jacob. And uh, so that's my uh, free advertising. Um, and the more I can steal from uh, Father Jarrett, uh, the better. <laughs> all right. We have our answers on here. All right, ready? So first question, <laughs> name a liturgical season in the church. You said Lent survey says. What, what's the point Good total? Answer. What's the point total we're going for? 200. Oh, okay. My. Okay. Good answer. I think we got, I think we got it, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> I think you got it. Uh, name a saint whose name begins with T you said. Thomas, survey says. Good answer. Answer. Nice. Uh, name a sacrament. You said baptism, survey says. <laughs> 237. <laughs> what? No. Okay, right. I'll take it, whatever. <laughs> You're going for a thousand points. <laughs> we'll make you go to 400 points. Apparently we didn't do our math right yesterday. <laughs> All right, uh, name one of the 12 apostles. You said Peter, survey says. 90. <laughs> okay, yeah, we'll go to 400, okay. <laughs> and the last question, name a Marian apparition. You said Fatima, survey says. <laughs> <laughs> uh, All right, 400, we got it. All right. You. you got the number one answer for everything except for the liturgical season. Wow. Okay. So we can have Father Gale come in and do it if you want. Yeah, he should. He should yeah, do it. He should I just want it. to see what he does. Okay. Tell him to come back in, I guess. <laughs> just tell him to turn around immediately. <laughs> yeah, you should, uh, you should leave zeros. You should like leave those like zeros on the board. It won't let me. Oh, dang it. Can you tell him he has to get to a thousand? Oh my gosh. Can you get to a thousand with, a, with the way we did the math? Maybe. How did, how did you do the math? Math, we could figure it out. Apparently not good enough. <laughs> no, I am just, I'm just that good, I guess. Is my back, my back, my back. Yes, turn around, don't look at the computer. Okay. Get the All right. Profile. Well, Father Jared, did for, you, can you can you see that? me on the screen? Yes. I've always been noted for having a very nice profile. You're, Gail, your other side's better. Turn around. Turn, yeah. turn to the other I've side. Always, I've always yeah. thought that. I've always thought that. Father Gail, you have a lot of ground to make up. If you don't okay. get a certain amount of points, then you guys will lose. Well, I, I understand how that works, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do it. All right. Second round's who, a little bit harder. Who, who you go like bah, if I if I say the same thing he said. I think I'll just make a buzzer noise with my mouth. <laughs> okay. 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 Perfect. I will start after I read the first question. Name a liturgical season in the church. Christmas time. Name a saint <laughs> whose name begins with T. 
Saint Thomas. <laughs> Saint Timothy. <laughs> Name a sacrament. The Eucharist. Name one of the twelve apostles. Peter. Uh, Saint name, John. Name a Marian apparition. Our Lady of Fatima. Uh, Nuestra Señora de Guadalupe. <laughs> awesome. Let me add your points. Uh. I do like I do like that answer. I like that last answer. How did you do, Connor? How did you do all right? Usually, uh, you don't know how many points? They, uh, like, like you usually say, you only need a few points, or you yeah. need a lot of points because you, you your buddy, Lemo. So we were playing to two hundred, and then he got four hundred and sixteen points. So, <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> well, I had to move it up to a thousand. All right, ready? 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 <laughs> right. That's pretty good. So I think we're going to, I don't know, 800? <laughs> might as no. Well. no. Yeah, yeah, sure. sure. Let's, Let's do 800. Good. Good. Makes we sense. Do 800. No. We got 800. We got it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think it's happening if we're going to 800. It's not we got, happening. We got over 800. I see the numbers right now. We have over 800. I'm good at math. I, know I, I saw I, her enter the numbers. Oh, those, are numbers. <laughs> those are your numbers. Those are your numbers. I was adding up your numbers. So I'm sorry if there are any misspells. All right. <laughs> Okay, name a liturgical season in the church. You said yeah. Christmas. That was that was not my best. Uh, <laughs> mm. Well, what number, you, could number you one. Try, could you try Christmas with a capital C? <laughs> Very quickly. Um, the number one answer was Advent. Oh, wow, really? That's weird. Advent was number two. So. All right, name a saint whose name begins with T. You said... Timothy. Good answer. <laughs> well, I'm sure Thomas is number one, but what else is there? There's Teresa. Number uh, one was, was Thomas. So number two? number two was Teresa. Boom. Oh, yeah. Name a sacrament, you said. Eucharist survey says. <laughs> This is so weird because we've already won, but I still feel like a loser. Number <laughs> one. <laughs> All right, name one of the twelve apostles. I spelled this one wrong. I'm sorry. Oh, I didn't. I spelled it right. Well, John. Spell I hope so. <laughs> wow. All right, and finally, we'll go to five. We'll go to five hundred, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's go to five hundred. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Name a Marian apparition. You said the Lady of Guadalupe. I like it. <laughs> Wad. Wow. We did it. I think that gets you guys a new car or something like that. I don't know. Talk to your bishop. <laughs> yeah. I thought the Dodge City Diocese Man. pays if we win. That's how Señora it works. Señora Nuestra, Señora Nuestra Guadalupe. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm just trying to get the camera on me so they, my background is Guadalupe. So, you know, it's whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mercy. Okay. Thank you for playing the game. Do you got anything else for the people? <laughs> I do. Starting at 8 o'clock tonight, uh, Thirsty Thursday on St. Isidore's Facebook page, Deacon Brian McCaffrey speaking on G.K. Chesterton. So if you're nothing to do, if, if you're nothing to do, uh, <laughs> come on over to the St. Isidore's website. We'd love to have your Facebook page. Live streaming at 8. Awesome. awesome. And also, I would just like to say this was way more fun than I could have ever imagined, mostly just because it's good to be with these other five guys and you two young ladies. I uh, miss you guys, love you guys. I wish I was around you more, but uh, things like this are incredible. So yeah, Emma and Matea, thank you for suggesting this. We'll keep doing some stuff like this. I think it's good for me and I think it's good for the people. So bless you. Yeah, we'll yeah, see if Wichita all. Diocese wants to go up against Salina as a Second round. They are so scared. Let me say it right here. Wichita, the Diocese of Wichita, does not have what it takes. <laughs> <laughs> the Salina oh, Diocese. Let's go. Let's go, man. Uh, have anything fun to share or announce? 
I want to say thank you to Father Wesley and Cathedral of Our Lady of Guadalupe for the idea to play mm -hmm. Family Feud and also to Matea for reaching out to me and doing all of the hard work and behind the scenes stuff. Thanks for putting this together. I also had a lot of fun. I'm glad it worked out. I would just like to request that Father Jarrett wears that wig more often. <laughs> <laughs> can do, can do. <laughs> That might be, that might have been a bad decision to make that request. <laughs> That's all I needed, baby. I appreciate it. <laughs> Father Jacob, Father Ted, have anything to say? Thank you. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Agreed. Agreed. Um, Salina. No, nothing, nothing to add. Thanks so much for putting this together. This was great. Yeah, thank you guys. I think what there's like over a thousand screams watching. So for everybody that's watching, we love you guys and we miss you guys too. Yeah, so we can't wait until we can be with you and give you the Eucharist and celebrate with you. We just can't wait. Amen. And put out put out your suggestions for future game shows or things you'd like to see. We'll do it. We'll do it again. This was a lot of fun. Yeah.